How many crime scene detectives do they have? I mean, crime scene is a science. Mm. If a crime should happen today in the upper west, a crime should happen, let's say a homicide should happen in the uh, northeast, should happen in, in most of right. these uh, regions, they have to send a crime scene uh, investigators from Accra to the region. Do, do, and do, anything do, 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 beyond 48 hours, right. you are likely to lead to, 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 you lose a lot of vital information. So, so we need to have we don't, a comprehensive information. Right, because we don't, we don't have all of the time, uh, the, the report is still indicating very clearly that uh, politicians are still in that habit of threatening journalists across the country. What's your expectation from the law enforcement agencies going forward? Well, I think that when, when a journalist is threatened, I, they, and the IGP has shown us, he's shown that he has in his knife cuts both left and right, as far as I'm concerned. And I am happy when I see him do that. When you are threatened as a journalist, and, and he's been adequate enough, he will call you, talk to you himself, or maybe even visit you. Report it. Once you report, I am sure that whoever this politician is will be arrested. Some politicians, we used not to see that. Under his dispensation, some politicians have been arrested for traffic violations, have been arrested for other infractions. So I think that let's begin to see how we can work with the police. But confidence building, like uh, my brother, uh, Honorable uh, Peter Lantene Tuobu said, you know, the police needs to do as they are doing, do more to right. let the populace okay. believe in them and believe that they are going to help. Ghanaians reach wherever we want to reach in terms of press freedom and uh, our peace index as well.